evening and it's time for another group break video uh, which I will post on my blog hopefully Thursday morning and for this video we're going to keep the group break moving because I'm going to open uh, one of our bonus blasters this being the 2013 Topps Chrome we have two of these I'm going to open one today um, remember with the Chrome as I said from the beginning I'm actually going to keep uh, some of the base cards if they're the ones that I still need from my set and I need one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I need ten out of the 220 base cards. So I'm hoping between the two Chrome Blasters that I picked up for myself a long time ago uh, to get those ten cards. But everything else, refractors, everything else is going into the group break, um, along with all the, of course, the uh, 210 base cards that I already own uh, go in the group break as well. So um, I'm missing ten. The numbers have been on my blog. I posted those a while ago, and I wrote them down so that I can double check as we go, and I'll let you know. And then I'm also going to open up uh, another one of the rack packs because I have a few of these to do, or yet a couple. Um, this being from the 2006 set, and I think I'll start with this one just so that everyone gets a bunch of cards right up front because these have, um, well, they have a lot of cards in them, and that's kind of a nice thing to do so no gum or anything in the 2006 set but lots of cards and we start with the one that we knew about this was the one that's on top Nick Johnson for the Nationals and then we've got Devi Cruz for the Cardinals I've never heard of him Clint Barnes for the Rockies Albert Pujols for the Cardinals I have heard of him of course Alex Gonzalez for the Marlins the Devil Rays are on the board with Chad Orvella Gilmesh, Gilmeshi, uh, for the Mariners. Uh, Chris DeMaria, that's a Brewers rookie card. And the nice thing about the two, the 2006 set's actually pretty solid. You get a little cartoon on the back. You get the uh, team logo, um, or I guess you get the team name logo, which is different from the team logo, of course. David Eckstein for the Cardinals. Another Cardinal, Anthony Reyes. The Cardinals are getting a lot here. Uh, we've got Damaso Marte for the White Sox. The Nationals, Brian Schneider. Connor Jackson, rookie card for the Diamondbacks. Jonathan Papelbon for the Red Sox. Um, Kevin Euclid for the Red Sox. Morgan Ensberg for the Astros. Brad Halsley for the Athletics. The Nationals get John Patterson. The Reds get the Big Reds. Adam Dunn and Ken Griffey Jr., um, I don't actually know if I had that card. It doesn't ring any bells, so that's cool for me. Reds team card. Um, the Mets get Jose Reyes and Kaz Matsui for the Mets middlemen. Pretty nice card there for the Mets. And uh, let's see, the Mets were Keith this time around, and then the Dodgers get a team card. So that's the rack pack, um, just to, again, boost out lots of bonus stuff. Now we'll get to the one that is a little bit more interesting to more people, probably, because it's a whole blaster worth of cards. And take the plastic wrap off. I really miss with the blasters the uh, old upper deck style where it was a lid here, and then you could lift the lid up and actually use the blaster to hold cards. Um, that's how I actually sort all my extra cards, by using old blasters. And now, with the top-style blaster that you have to open from the top, these are totally worthless for trying to store cards in. Um, at least if you're going to try to actually use them and get them out often. So, um, this just ends up being trash. I'll keep it for now because it has the odds on the side in case we pull anything cool. But, um, yeah, they're disappointing. So, we get... Um, what do we get in here? We get seven packs plus one bonus purple refractor pack. So we should have seven packs here for there's seven. And then we have our one, I'm assuming this is the bonus refractor pack since uh, it's not labeled at all. So we'll uh, we'll save the, actually we'll do the refractors first. I don't know what these look like, so I'm as curious as anybody else. Again, this is from the 2006 set. No, just kidding, the 2013 set, that's what I meant to say. And we start with our first purple refractor being Ryan Howard for the Phillies. So these are actually pretty sharp looking. I think I have, maybe some people have traded me or thrown some of these in. 
I think I have seen some purple ones, but they're cool. Next we have for the Braves, Chris Medlin. For the Red Sox, Mike Napoli. And our fourth and final purple refractor goes to the Padres. And the Padres are picked up by David, and he's getting Casey Kelly. So nice to see the Padres get on the board there. Um, seven packs. Again, the purple refractors, I'm not looking at numbers, but the rest of these I'll try to check the numbers to see if any of these are actually base cards that I need as we go through. So in no particular, well, let's put them in a particular. I see we have a good card right off the bat. So let's start, though, from the beginning. Brian McCann for the Braves. And that is not one that I need. Russell Martin for the Pirates. Also not one that I need. And the hero so far in the Mets game today that's going on right now as I do this, Lucas Duda for the Mets. And again, not one that I need. All of those are just regular base cards. But then the fourth card is a black bordered refractor numbered uh, 061 out of 100. And it's also going to the Mets. And that is Jonathan Neese for the Mets. Black border refractor. I don't know if that's going to come out on the camera there, but it is numbered uh, 061 out of 100. Maybe there you can maybe catch that in the light. Um, and according to the blaster, which is why we kept these, a black refractor is one in 425 retail packs. So if this is any indication of how this group break is going to go, our first actual pack of anything that has anything cool in it, um, we might be in store for a really good time. At least I certainly hope so. So congratulations, uh, Keith, once again. Moving on to our next pack, we have Ben Revere of the Phillies, which I don't need. We have Derek Holland of the Rangers, which I also do not need. We have Justin Morneau for the Twins. Whoops, for the Twins, 217, which is not one I need. I need card 220. And then we have a refractor for the Pirates. That's Justin Wilson. Nice little refractor rookie card there. So uh, not as exciting as that black bordered card, but not bad. Again, I'm still hoping to pick up those last 10 pesky base cards for myself, but no luck so far. Uh, next up, Oswaldo Arcia for the Twins, which I do not need. Kevin Gaussman for the Orioles, which I also do not need. That was card 186 and 194. They're both four away from the one I need, which is 190. Then we have James Shield, card 202. For the Ray, uh, for the Royals rather, I uh, don't need that one either. And then for the Red Sox, we have one of the X Fractors, kind of shiny, sparkly thing, um, Alan Webster for the Red Sox. So that's Gavin getting that one. Four packs remain, and the first blaster of the group break. And again, we still have all the boxes, of course. 181 is Ian Desmond of the Nationals, not one that I need. Chris Sale of the White Sox, also not one that I need. Jonathan Pettibone of the Phillies, another one that's going in the break because I don't need it. And Jason Kipnis, this is card 120, I need card 119. So again, four more base cards, zero help for my set. This is becoming a bummer and already for me personally, but getting a blackboard card was cool. Evan Longoria. I like that card. Very nice. I have it though, so uh, that's in the raised pile. We have a refractor of Paul Konerko for the White Sox. Very nice refractor there. Billy Butler. Royals. Don't need it. And Ben Zobrist. For the Rays. Another card that I do not need. Two packs left. 
which means this blaster will not finish my set because the most I could get was eight base cards for these remaining two packs, and I need ten. Gio Gonzalez, Nationals. Anthony Rizzo for the Cubs. Uh, David Fries. Almost. I need card 133 and 136. This is card 135. So for the Cardinals it goes. And we have an insert. Um, one of the 1972 style cards. The Tombstone style. This is Josh Hamilton of the Angels. So a nice pickup for the Angels. Uh, which claimed by Josh. And my last hopes of getting any closer to my set reside in this pack. We also can get signatures, autographs are in the blasters, I believe. They're pretty rare, um, but they do exist. Uh, looking at this quickly, yeah, there's a whole bunch of different kinds. They don't give you the overall odds, but they're pretty rare. So if we got one, we'd be really lucky. Anyways, Trevor Bauer for the Indians. I do not need that one. Miguel Cabrera for the Tigers, which I also already own. Jackie Bradley Jr., card 166. I don't need that one either. That's going to the Red Sox pile. And my last hope is Mike Olt, which I also already own. So there's the blaster. Good for everybody else. I didn't take a single base card from anybody because we didn't pull any of the 10 that I needed. Another decent-sized stack joining the rest of the team. Uh, stacks I've already started to sort, and I hope you enjoy that. We're going to keep the good times going as we uh, crank through the group break. I'll plan to probably do a box and a couple of bonus packs each video just to keep things uh, from being too long and also for sorting purposes and for scanning purposes because I will uh, probably by the time you, most of you see this video, I'll actually have a post written and scan some of the better hits. So certainly that black bordered chrome card, uh, for instance. So thanks for watching. Stay tuned for more, and I'll see you later.